Hey guys, it's Erica from Una Vita Pilates. Welcome to day five. So today we're going back into a lower body focus. So we're gonna be doing squat series today. So let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna start at the back end of the mat. Okay, and we're gonna start with our roll down. So we're gonna take a nice inhale in, dropping those shoulders. Exhaling, softening in those knees, rounding down and reaching and giving everything a nice little shake. And then slowly tucking tail, rounding, lifting, coming all the way back up here, lengthening nice and tall. Let's go again here. Exhale, round it down. Good. And just shake it on out, releasing that tension. Starting to let your body relax for the next 30 minutes to focus. We're gonna go right into some squats. So we're gonna take an inhale, sit back into that chair. Exhale, squeeze those glutes, squeeze those inner thighs, lift. So inhale down, okay, and exhale, lift. So sitting all the way back, getting those knees over toes. Exhale, squeeze, lift up. Chest stays nice and lifted here. So we're gonna focus on a lot of squat work today, a lot of lower body. Okay, exhale, lift it up and come down. We've got another four like this, nice and low. Good. For three. For two. Last one. And then lift it up. We're gonna come right into some high knees here. Lifting and reaching. Arms up and pull, up and pull, up and pull, up and pull. Good, using those abdominal muscles to lift those legs. Can you go for another five, for four, for three, for two, and one. Coming back to that mat, take a nice inhale in, exhale round, come down here. We're gonna walk it on out, come down onto those knees, push through those palms, round that back, come into your cat and cow here, and release. And again, push up and in, and release. And then push up and in, and release, nice work. Curl those toes under, shoulders over the wrists, knees under the hips, hover those knees off, start to engage those abdominals, and then tap down. Exhale, lift, squeeze up. Push through those palms, drop those shoulders, neck in line with the spine. Nice work, we go five more here for five, for four, for three, for two, and last one, nice work. We're gonna curl those toes, lift those hips, drop those heels, and just shake it all out here. Nice work. Pedal out those heels, left and right. Okay, we're gonna walk it back, stand it up, and we're gonna go right into our first squat series. All right, so from here, I'm gonna start at the left edge of my mat, we're gonna come down into a nice low squat. We're gonna stay low. We're gonna take one, two, three steps to the right, and then one, two, three steps to the left. So staying nice and low the whole time. Chest is lifted, okay? And right to left, right to left. Nice work, come back across here, good. And then last time, we're gonna bring it all the way back over. Now from here, I'm gonna take the hands back behind the head. I'm gonna squat down, lift that left knee to right elbow. Squat down, lift left to right. Squat, little oblique and rotation work here. And use that breath, shh. And exhale, shh. Good, and exhale, shh. Nice work, shh. You got it, shh. Good, and in. Last four here. For three, we've got one more set in this series. For two. And last one. Good, now we're gonna come down, extend right leg, down. Stay on that left, down. Left knee over toe. Extend that right leg and lift, you've got that. Outer glute, outer thigh here. Lift it up, last three on this side. 
we go straight into the other for two and one now squat and lift left squat and lift left squat and lift left squat nice work you've got four keep going for three Woo. you've got two and last one shake it on out nice work heart rate should be up all right let's take that inhale exhale round to down here walk yourself out into a plank here hold it here hold drop down and come into a child's pose nice work just breathe through and then we're gonna sit it back we're gonna swing those legs around and do a little bit of core work here so let's slowly round down holding on to the backs of the thighs Lie yourself all the way down here place those hands back behind the head okay and then from here we're gonna go ahead lift those legs into a tabletop position we're gonna exhale extend those legs up towards the ceiling inhale lower head bend legs okay so options to modify keep the head neck and shoulders uh, lowered if you have any neck tension okay and we're continuing here you can also keep the legs just in tabletop or if it's too much on your lower back feel free to go ahead and just do some abdominal curls here all right so we're gonna finish this set for another three for two and one we're gonna hold it here we're gonna inhale, lower those legs. Exhale, lift. Inhale, down. Keep those elbows out nice and wide. Head is nice and heavy in those palms. Thumbs come down the back of the neck to support. Navel pulled into the mat here. Inhale, down. Exhale, scoop from those low abdominals. Nice work. You've got four. Inhale, lower it down. For three. Good. And then you've got two. And last one. Bend it in here. Okay. And we're going to lower. Take a quick reset. And then send those legs right back up here. And now we're going to reach opposite arm to opposite leg. Dropping that leg. So right arm reaches to the outside of the left leg. Right leg lowers. And change. Okay. So options to modify. Okay. We can keep that knee bent. Not extended. Or alternatively, you can on the ground and lift reach okay so we want to reach to the outside so the goal is to get to the outside of that ankle okay if you can't get to the ankle get to the shin get to the outside of the knee find that rotation and send that rib over that opposite hip they okay, use that breath twist nice work reach you got it reach and lift reach good last four you've got three two and one and you're out of it bring those knees in give everything a nice little shake we're gonna send those legs down for our bridge work here so back into some glutes arms can either be up towards the ceiling to make it a bit more challenging or down on the floor we're gonna get those heels just underneath the knees push through those heels, lift up, find that nice ski slope, E, hip, shoulder, one straight line here, shoulder blades pull back and down, and slowly come down, so no collapsing here, finding that nice stability, pushing through the heels, using those glutes to lift, squeezing everything at the top, and then exhale, rounding, coming down, upper back, mid back, lower back, nice work, we exhale, lift up, and squeeze, good and then again come up and squeeze it up and lower good and again come up and squeeze we go three more like this and two and last one hold it up tiny little pulses up for ten nine eight seven six five four three two one hold it up can we push those knees out towards the side open the knees and close you've got it open and close Woo. open and close nice work all the way to those heels
heels, no, no weight in the toes. Good. Keeping those hips nice and level and lifted. You've got three. For two. Last one. And lower. Come down here. Here, we're going to add those two together. We're going to exhale, lift up, open, close, and lower. Again, exhale, lift, squeeze, open, close, and lower. Lift, open, close, and lower. You've got it. Up, open, close, and lower. Can we go five more here? You should really be feeling it in those glutes, reaching through those thighs. Nice work. Almost there, guys. For two. And then last one. And lower it down. Okay, to finish off this series, we're going to go single leg marching here. So we're going to exhale, lift it up, stay lifted. So no dropping in those hips. Hip bones stay level. We lift, reach right leg, and lift, reach left. And lift, reach right. Nice 90 degree angles and left. Notice there's no dipping in my hips, right? Really pushing through that the supporting heel and lift, exhale it up. You've got it, lift. Come on, let's go another five. And then we finish off this set for four. You've got three for two and one. Nice work. Come on down. Let's take a quick little stretch here. Get that right foot over left knee. Pull that left thigh in. Push that right leg away and just relax it here. Nice work. And then changing sides. Left comes over right. And releasing. Excellent work. And we're going to do one more set while we're down here. So for those of you who have any back issues um, or are a little bit weaker in the core, I'm going to give you a nice modification. And then if you're up for the full exercise, we'll go into the full exercise. All right, so we'll all start with the modification here, which is going to be a little reverse curl. So again, a little bit of low abdominal work here. So we're going to bring the knees into table stop, top, pushing through the palms. We're going to start to lift the hips. So bringing those knees back in towards the nose. Exhale, scoop lift. Nice work. Again, scoop lift. Okay, so you can either stay here or we're going to go into our full roll over. All right, so we bring the knees up, reach. If we can, we're going to lower those feet down towards the floor as far as you can. If you can get the feet down, go ahead and push those toes down into the floor. Lift up, open those legs out so they're as wide as the shoulders, and then we're slowly rolling down vertebrae by vertebrae, keeping everything nice and flat on the floor. Bring the legs together here, four to five. Take an inhale, exhale, scoop, reach. Good. Pushing through those palms, lengthening through the back of the neck, the back of the legs, knees over nose. If you can, we're going to drop, we're going to open the legs, drop those toes, find that stretch, and then come back onto those shoulder blades, point those toes, and slowly come down. Head, neck, and shoulders stay flat. Use those abdominals, pull in through the core. Use the arms to support if you need. Head, neck, and shoulders don't lift, and bring it all the way back. Let's do that one more time. Exhale, reach and scoop. Open those legs, flatten those toes if you can, otherwise just reach as far as you can. Find your stretch wherever it feels good for you. And then from here, point those toes and slowly come back down, vertebrae by vertebrae. The last thing to come down is the low back and reach it all in here and shake it out. Nice work. We're going to slowly rock ourselves back up to seated. Come over onto our back and then lift up, stand it up, and we're going right back into our second squat series. So we're gonna start again on that left side of the mat. We're gonna go into those squat walks. So we come down, chest lifted, and we're going over to the right side, three steps over and three steps back. So I'm staying the same level the whole time. My knees are tracking over my toes. I'm taking nice wide steps, working that lower body, and reaching. Nice work. You've got it. Coming down. Woo. Good. Can we go one more all the way over to the right and then back to the left and we're going to go back in to those obliques. Hands are going to come back behind the head. 
Okay, we're gonna step nice and wide and twist left to right. Exhale, twist. Good, and reach. Nice work. You got it. Really try and get that knee to that elbow. You've got it, squatting down, come nice and low in the center. Good. You've got three more, and we finish off with those leg lifts to the side. Last one. Okay, and now we're gonna go right in to that right side. So coming into that squat and reaching. Sit back into that left heel. Get that heart rate up. Use those glutes. Woo. You've got four. For three. For two. And one right into that right leg. Lift that left. You've got it. Squat it down. Good. And lower. And lift you. Nice work. You've got five more here and you're out of it. For four. For three. You've got two. And one. And shake it on out. Nice work. All right. We're gonna do a nice little set of upper body here. Okay? We're gonna go a little stretch back into our squats and stretch to finish it out today. All right? So you're almost there. <laughs> so from here, we take that nice inhale, drop those shoulders down, scoop up and over, softening in those knees, rounding down, and we're gonna walk out into that plank. We're gonna hold it here, okay? Option to modify, come down onto the knees, we're going push-ups. We're inhaling and exhaling, neck in line with that spine, navel pulled up and in. We've got seven, make them count. You're only in it for 10, okay? So modify if and when you need, otherwise push through. We've got four more here for four. Nice work for three. You've got two and one and come out of it. Take a quick child's pose here. Excellent work. Really, really nice. Coming forward. Our next set in this round are shoulder taps. So we're gonna come back again. Feel free to do these in a half plank on the knees. Otherwise, you're gonna come up into your plank. We're gonna tap opposite shoulder, trying not to rock too much. Really push up and in here. Can we go another six, five, four, three, two, and one, and you're out of it. Nice work, come on down. We've got one more set in this series, and then we're gonna repeat it again. <laughs> Come back up, gonna come into that plank. So we can either go out, out, in, in, or we can go out and in jacks. Softening in those elbows, keeping those hips down. You've got another six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work, sit it back, woo. Take a stretch, child's pose, let everything relax. So we're gonna go ahead and do that same round, those three exercises, 10, 10 repetitions each, another two times, all right? So our upper body focus for this class. So we go back to those push-ups. Again, modify as you need, but let's keep it going. So we're lifting up and we're exhaling and inhale. Let's pick up the pace and come up, inhale, exhale. You're halfway there already for five and lift, you've got four, and lift, come on, for three, you've got two, and last one, and sit it back. Take a quick child's pose here, not time to stretch just yet, just a quick little release to continue. We got shoulder taps, come on up, tap it out, right to left, left to right, right to left, left to right. Breathe it through, you're halfway there, you've got four, three, two, and one, tap it down. Okay, a little plank jacks to finish off round two of this set. Come up, remember out, out, in, in, or out and in for eight, seven, hips are down, six, tummy pulled in, draw that navel up and in, soften through those elbows for three, two, and one. Now you're out of it. Nice work, really 
knees. Catch your breath, let your body reset. You have one more round to push through. For the upper body, we're gonna take a nice little upper body stretch. Go back into those squats, finish off that low body, stretch you out 30 minutes, and you'll be done for today. All right, let's finish it. Nice and strong. Take this at your own pace. Make sure that the movements are good ones, okay? Every movement counts. Exhale and then take it at your own pace. Two counts up, two counts down. And lift, you're already halfway for five. You've got four, for three, for two, and one. And tap it down, release it out, shoulders reset. We come back into those shoulder taps here. Come on up, you've got this. Lift it up. You can extend the legs a little wider for more support here if you need. Or come down onto the knees for five, for four, three, two, and one. And last one, you've got your quick set of plank jacks here. Really, really nice, guys. Let's lift it up. Bring the feet together, go out and in. Don't let those hips lift. Soften in those elbows, relax through that jaw. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Sit it back and release into your child's pose here. You can bring the hands back, let the elbows come down, forehead down, and rest in your stretch. Nice work. Really, really nice. Oops. <laughs> Rounding it up, I'm gonna turn to face you. And we're gonna stretch out those arms. So take that right hand up, palm faces back, reach down to the back of that neck, grab onto that elbow, and push yourself here. And then release, take that right arm across, drop that shoulder and pull the right arm in. Let that heart rate come down. And then again, lift it up, reach, grab onto that elbow with that right hand, keep the chin lifted here, find that stretch. And then release, take that left arm across, drop it down, hold it here, nice work. Really, really nice. Okay, and then from here, we're gonna come forward, curl those toes under, lift those hips up, walk yourself up nice and slow. Last thing to come up is the crown of the head. We've got one more squat set before we go into a nice stretch. All right, so right to left, oblique knee, re raise, uh, knee twists, sorry, knee raises twists, and then we finish with those side lifts. All right, let's do this. We come down here, chest lifted, Come on up, we come across. Tap, chest is lifted. I'm pushing through my palms, my belly button's pulled up and in. So using the upper body for support, staying nice and low, reaching nice and wide, bringing those feet together on each step, meeting in the middle. Really, really nice here. Pushing through, you guys are almost there. Really nice work. Good. And then last time across. And then we're gonna come in, bring those arms up. We're gonna sit it down, twist lift. So I'm coming into a wide position. Knees about as wide as my shoulders and lifting. Again, chest stays lifted here. Reach and exhale, twist, reach. And twist, reach. Good. Twist, reach. And twist, reach. Nice work. Breathing through, releasing all that air as you twist to the side. Last two. And we're gonna go into those left leg, right leg reaches. Sit it back and down. Send all that weight into that left heel. Left toe should be able to lift. Working through that left glute and right side. We've got five more on this leg. For four, for three, for two. Going right into that right squat here. Send it down, left leg shoots out. And lift, and lift, and reach. You've got seven, make them count. Last time through, 
for five, for four, for three, for two, and you're out of it. Shake it out. Really, really nice work. Come to the back side of the mat here. We're gonna take a nice inhale in. Exhale around, come down. Walk those hands out. And then go ahead and just bring that right leg down and just lean into your stretch here. Okay, wherever you land, just taking that release through that glute. Lots of lower body work today. Okay, if you can't get the head down, you can stay lifted. Just staying true to your body and what feels good for you. This is your stretch. Taking the inhale in and exhale out. Trying to keep the hips nice and square here and really just reaching through. Right leg straight up towards the ceiling. Take one final little release. Come down into your downward. Take that left leg, shoot the left leg forward, and come all the way down here. Just being mindful again, each side is different. Give yourself a minute to relax into the stretch. Taking nice inhales in and exhales out. Lowering a little bit deeper in each breath. Bringing the hands to the outside of the left foot, pulling the right hip back, letting the head lift the shoulders high. And then come back center, come over to the right, pulling the left hip back, knees towards nose. And come back center, and slowly round, lift. The last thing to come up is the crown of the head. Let's finish off together with one final inhale in. Bring hands into prayer, pushing through palms, exhaling. Nice work. I'll see you tomorrow for day six, where we're going to go back into an upper body series, and then we'll finish off day seven, putting it all together.